unveiled not one, but two mascots for the capital city's new baseball team. For more on the addition to the Yard Goat family, here is a member of our family, Catalina Trevino. She's live in Hartford. All right, Catalina, we're dying, waiting with bated breath. What is it? Okay, well, first I have to tell you more than 4,000 names were submitted online back in July to try and name these goats. And like you said, they couldn't go with just one goat. They went with two. Carrie Lee, now say hello here without further ado to Chompers and Choo Choo. Now, Chompers is a male, large, green, furry goat. Choo Choo is a little bit smaller. She's blue, but let me tell you guys, they are both larger than life. They have big, bright uh, smiles, and you can't miss them. Now, they were greeted this morning by Capital Preps. Students and their neighbor, their neighbors here in Hartford, and officials say they just had to go with two mascots because they believe that Hartford needed it. We wanted a mascot that was fun, appeal to all ages as our community ambassador, and of course lead the cheers at Yard Goats home game at Dunkin' Donuts Park right across the street. Now, of course, NBC Connecticut is one of the media sponsors to the Hartford Yard Goats. Here are our friends now. So, how's it feel, guys, to be unveiled to the world today? Yeah, a lot to say, guys. So, we'll be looking forward to seeing them next April. We're live here in Hartford. <laughs> Catalina Trevino, NBC Connecticut News. I think there was a thumbs up or something in there. We don't speak goat, so we'll have to uh, get used to that. Chompers and choo choo. <laughs> right? Thumbs up, guys. <laughs>